This time, I'm going to talk about how we can calibrate whole white model in Python. More than two years ago, I made a YouTube video with subject parameter estimation of Vasicek interest rate model and its limitation. If you haven't watched that video, you are welcome to go to my YouTube channel and watch that video first. From the viewers, I got a question asking how we can calibrate whole white model parameters. And in this video, I'm going to answer this question. First, let's take a look at whole white model. Whole white model is a one factor model and it has some assumptions. First, the speed of reversion is constant. Then, the volatility is constant. So, in whole white model, we have two parameters. And also, it has some features. Reversion level is time dependent. And the parameter theta t is chosen to make the model consistent with the initial term structure. I want to emphasize, in Vasicek model, this parameter theta is a constant. So, I cited some pages from this book in the following slides. This book it's written by Jiang Ho, and I have 6 edition, but I think the newest edition is 11th edition already, but the contents remain almost the same. You can see the whole white model is a one-factor model, and it has two parameters, A and Sigma. They are constant. And A is related to the reversion speed, and the sigma is related to the volatility. And if we know A and the sigma, we can calculate theta t from A and the sigma. Now, Let's compare the check model and the whole white model briefly. First, both models are mean reverting, one factor and normal processes with a constant variance for the short interest rate. The, the Vasicek is the equilibrium model and the whole white is the arbitrage free model. So they are quite different. The whole white can fit the initial term structure of interest rate, and the Vasicek model cannot. The whole white model is able to fit a given term structure of volatility, and the Vasicek model cannot. Then, both models suffer from the possibility of a negative interest rate. Both models are affine term structure models. Finally, under the models, the entire forward interest curve can be explicitly derived. Okay, now let's take a look at the calibration process in this example. First, I used European swaption in this example. Then, we need to determine term structure based on current interest rate and collect volatility data. Then, we will generate whole white model based on interest rate term structure. Then, we use Jamshidai swaption engine as the price engine. Then, we create swaption and use levenberg marquardt algorithm as calibration method. Finally, we will decide 
A and sigma with selected criteria after calibration. Let's take a look what's this Levenberg Marquardt algorithm. When we try to fit the data, if the data relationship is linear, we can use linear least squares fitting. But when the relationship is not linear, we have a nonlinear least square problem. And in this case, you are trying to find the minimum spot in this curve. In this case, we are going to use the Levenberg Marquardt algorithm. Now, let's go to Python, see how can we calibrate whole white model. As I mentioned before, first, we are going to create flat forward curve with current interest rate. And then, we collect volatility data. We will create a model based on the term structure and then we use Jamshidai swaption engine. After that, we can create a swaption and we use Leisenberg Marquardt method as our optimization method. After we decide the end criteria, we can run the calibration. And after the calibration, we will get our A and sigma, the two parameters for our model. Let's run the Python code. You can see the final result gave us the A and sigma and also give us cumulative error 0 0.11702 and also you see we can compare the model price and the market price the implied volatility and the market volatility i put this code in the github so you can go there get the source code and run it by yourself. This is how I calibrate whole white model in Python. Please provide your comments and subscribe to my channel. Thank you very much for watching.